go. Okay, today we're gonna read Karamo Brown's I Am Perfectly Designed. First there was you, Dad, then there was me. Now there is us. That's right, now there is us. When you first saw me, you said, he is perfectly designed from his head to his toes. And I met every word, still do. When I was a baby, I looked just like you. Only I had no hair and you had lots. Now it's the opposite. <laughs> so true. Re the first thing I remember is being carried on your shoulders while we walked to the park all over the city. Remember that? I had such a big baby head. Indeed, but your big baby head was perfectly designed for you. When I was little, I thought you could touch the moon, remember that? We'd sit on the roof and reach for it. One day, you'll be big enough to reach it yourself, but until then, it's perfectly okay to ask for help. Remember when we went as syrup and waffles for Halloween, Dad? Ha! How do I do? That was awesome. I wonder what will be this year. When I run in the park, jump in the park, climb trees in the park, and pretend I am a statue in the park, you remind me I am perfectly designed to explore the world. You are, and you always will be. Dad, when I grow up and leave home, will you miss me? Yes, very much. Will you go into my room and play with my race cars and stuffed animals? You know I will. Will you sit on the fire escape and, re and feed the pigeons like we do in the summer? The pigeons and the sparrows. Will you remember our favorite moves? I will, and I'll invent some new ones too. Dad, will you always think of me? Always. You know what, Dad? What? I will always remember walking through the city and sitting on your shoulders. And maybe when you're older and I'm taller, I can carry you on mine because we are perfectly designed for each other. That's right. Okay. Mm. All right. So that was I Am Perfectly Designed um, by Karamo Brown. And... Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you had a good week. I might do story time over the weekend. We'll wait and see. But I hope you have a good evening and that you're surrounded by loved ones. And I will see you next time.